think we have time to squeeze in one more question. I'm actually, it comes from Kayla via Twitter. And I'm going to modify Kayla's question a little bit. Kayla's asking, um, she's having a hard, uh, difficult time uh, organizing her study time. Do you have any tips for helping me work in a study schedule with my class schedule? And so the modification I'm going to make it to this is essentially, what big tip, what single tip would you offer to students who are getting ready for a rigorous year as pre-medical students? They've just come back to campus. What's your big tip for making sure that they have a strong schedule and they're, uh, they're sticking to what they need to do? Don't bite off more than you can chew. Don't say, I want to get through optics, respiratory system, acids, bases, and Grignard reagents uh, by Wednesday. It's not possible. Mm -hmm. Small chunks are going to get you to know the topic, and then you'll actually be able to success with it. I feel the same. I would just add on to that, that making times for yourself, making organization, organi organizing yourself is important. Don't get discouraged if you can't do it because there will be time you can push back your test. So just not getting discouraged is my biggest thing. Learning how to calm down yourself would be my biggest thing because I tend to get anxious before tests and things like that. What I've learned through the MCATs actually, coincidentally, is how to calm down and relax. Just enjoy what you're doing because if you want to be a doctor, most likely you love science. Don't let it become something that becomes a task, a heavy task. Love it, you know, and that's why put in time for friends and family, but just don't get overly anxious, because it's possible. It's absolutely possible. And Larry, as someone with years of, of experience in education, what would be your big tip for students coming back to campus right now? Um, I, I, I definitely am a big fan of having a, a plan. Uh, the, the other thing I would say is really to work in opportunities to come back to topics. I and mean, we talked about it a little bit before, but this idea of spacing out your studying, don't try to cram things in. Uh, it's really, you're, you're sort of gonna get a false positive by quickly testing yourself and thinking, oh, I've got it, I never need to see it again. People don't realize just how much their memory degrades over time. Check in again with the topic. Mm -hmm. It'll strengthen your understanding of the material.